613 now, Earth Day, it is happening tomorrow. And experts want you to say no to food waste. 10 TV meteorologist Ross Caruso walks us through composting the right way and how this can help eliminate food waste in your home and the landfill. We all eat and sometimes we unfortunately waste food. The Ohio EPA estimates that more food reaches landfills than any other single material in our everyday trash constituting roughly 22 to 24 percent of municipal waste. If we want also to grow food that is uh, more healthy or using better practices that are healthier for the environment and for us, composting provides us that opportunity. Lead environmental specialist for the composting program at the Ohio EPA, Angel Arejo Rodriguez, says that composting is a way to tackle this issue and it is very rewarding for your own lawn and garden. Increasing the capacity for the soil to retain water so it's more available long term for the plants. It reduces the amount of water that you need to use. It saves you money on water and fertilizer, and it doesn't take much to start composting. There are tumblers, um, there are plastic bins, um, there are wooden wire bins. You can make your own bin. You don't have to have a bin. It can be a pile, but you really don't need a lot of space uh, to compost. OSU Extension educator Mike Hogan says that it is important to have a balance between brown and green materials in your compost. Brown material is things like leaves, twigs, wood trimmings, um, wood chips. Um, newspaper. We can compost newspaper and even cardboard and, and should. Um, those are sources of carbon. And then we want to balance that with what we call green materials, things like kitchen scraps, um, grass clippings, green leaves, things like that. A well-maintained compost will yield great results fast. We, we want to make sure that in the center of the pile it's heating up and water is needed, moisture is needed for that. So when we have um, dry periods, when we're turning the compost pile and it's dry in the center, we may need to add some water with the, the garden hose or a watering can or something like that. Composting is something that I love to do and I do it each and every day. It's something that is easy to do and I've seen the benefits myself here in my own backyard, specifically in my garden. Not only are you helping to eliminate the waste in your own household, but ultimately eliminating the waste at the landfill. For more tips and tricks on how you can get started composting, go to 10tv.com. Reporting from my home here in Columbus, <laughs> Doppler 10 meteorologist Ross Caruso. We all know where to go now, Ross. Yeah. Thank you. To, here you go. Yeah, yeah. Compost Here's it. my right. trash. Right. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Yo, we're gonna, he's, gonna have to he's gonna have to teach us some more stuff because we have yeah. plenty of questions. Yes. And it looks like he's our expert on that yeah. for sure. You could go to Swaco's site. They have some really great okay. um, mm -hmm. suggestions on things you can do with prep and all those kinds of things because it's really very important. Mm -hmm.